Welcome to Top Solid 7 and this getting started tutorial. In this tutorial, we're going to learn how to use the check geometry function. This is useful for detecting errors within the imported geometries. After, I'll introduce you to the clean geometry function. This function attempts to fix geometric errors found during the checking process. Finally, I'll introduce you to the simplify geometry function. This function is awesome. It allows to remove unnecessary faces, converts geometry to simpler forms like planes, conic cylinders, spheres, whatnot. This also makes the database lighter. Finally, this makes the geometry easier to work with, makes it measurable, for example. Let's see how it all works. Okay, let's begin by checking the geometry. To do this, you need to be in the surfacing tab and then you can go over to this icon bar click on the black arrow to open it and go down to check so you know you can also click on the drop down menu from the surfacing tab go down to healing and choose check there as well both will get you where you need to be next the function is asking you for the shapes to check now if there's only one shape you can just go select it if there's a bunch of shapes it's sometimes simpler just to hit the select all shapes button after you hit the blue arrow to continue now in this case, the software found no invalid shapes. If invalid shapes were found, it would list them here. As well, it would go to your Entities Manager and it would create a new folder down here called Invalid Shapes, so that you had a list of everything that you needed to correct. Next, I'm going to introduce you to the Clean command. The Clean command is very simple. If you have a model that has invalid geometry in it, you run this command next, you can play with your tolerances, I wouldn't make them too loose, and let the software attempt to clean all the bad faces. Maybe there was a bow tied surface or a bad trimming boundary. This is stuff that we can automatically fix for you. You hit the blue arrow and go. Finally, I want to introduce you to the simplify command. This is probably one of the coolest features uh, in this tool set. I'm going to go ahead and select the model and hit go. And based on these tolerances, the software is going to analyze the model and it's going to check every single face and edge on the model. Here it was able to simplify 306 faces and 325 edges back to simple forms of geometry. This means maybe during the translation they were translated as uh, complex forms of geometry like splines or B-rep surfaces and we were able to measure them and convert them back to simple forms like conics, cylinders, and spheres. I hope you found this tutorial to be useful. Thanks for watching. Thank you.